Hello everyone, so after I bought my softbox something like two weeks ago, which I'm using right now uh, from Amazon, from a company called ASDDI um, they mailed me and they sent me a softbox for free, thank you very much guys uh, they want me to make like a review about this softbox I will open it in front of you, I will try it in front of you I will say my opinion honestly, like always I will say what I like about this softbox the most and if there's something I don't like I will tell you about it so I will open the softbox in front of you and we will see together everything that comes in the box we will try it together I will also put any interesting subject maybe I will take a photo for this mic for example to take an idea about the power of the light to take an idea about the shutter speed after using the two softbox I will tell you about the camera setting the ISO the f-stop and the shutter speed just to have an idea about the light power so I will turn on the room light and I will open the softbox here in front of you so I will try to put the mic here near my face because last time there was a lot of echo and my voice was very bad So I think this is the first lamp and this is the second lamp. Uh, this is the first softbox and uh, the second softbox. So there's a card inside saying that there's a lucky gift for you. You can send them an email and you become a gift from uh, these four items you choose one of them and you got a gift a tripod for mobile or octopus tripod also for mobile and wired hand and three primary color pulp and this is also a one year warranty and the last one we got here the user manual This tripod is exactly the same tripod that came with my softbox. So this is the first one. Now I will put the lamps. So as you can see, this is the first lamp. So I will put the diffuser. I will turn them on I will turn off the room light and let's see so as you can see right now I'm putting one on the left and one on the right and yeah they are so strong I can say they are stronger than my softbox because my softbox is 85 watt but now I have two lamps and every lamp is 50 watt so something like 100 watt yeah, it's, um, yeah, they are stronger than my softbox. So as I said, I will try to take a photo of this uh, mic, for example, just to have an idea about the shutter speed that I can have with different f-stops. So as I said, right now I am putting the mic, as you can see, between the two softbox and I will see what shutter speed I can use with different f-stops. I will show you everything. So the first photo my ISO is 100 and 
I'm using f1.8 and my shutter speed is 1 200 of the second which is very good for handheld photos so I'll try now to go something like f5.6 or something like that so now my f-stop is 5.6 and I'm using uh, 120 of the second which means you have to use a tripod if you want to use something like f9 or something like that for food photography and you want everything to be sharp then you have to use a tripod so at the end I would say the light quality is very good I like it a lot and the length of the stand is 200 centimeter which is very good for portrait photography if you want to take photos of anyone and you you want the softbox to be above the head there's only one thing I I don't understand why actually this softbox is 5400 Kelvin and it's a little bit more yellow than my old softbox which is 5500 Kelvin and only the difference is only 100 Kelvin and you don't feel this, this difference, you don't feel this difference only when you put the Boss softbox in front of you, you feel that the new one, this one, a little bit more yellow than the old one. But it's not a very big difference, as I said, only 100 Kelvin, I don't know why, but my old softbox is more white than this one. Yeah, but as I said, the light quality is very good and yeah as you can see so this is everything for today i hope you found this video helpful i hope you could find everything you need to know about this softbox and thank you again guys for sending me this softbox it's really very good i don't i really don't think anyone needs more than this light quality for making videos food uh, photography still life photography i don't think anyone needs more than this light so thank you very much for watching this video please consider subscribing if you are not already and see you in the next video bye